So if you follow my videos, you'll know that um, we lost Neep a couple of weeks ago. And Cade is now the last of our old boys crew. Um, we noticed he's been getting a little bald patch in the back of his neck there. And that's actually the scar site where he had a benign tumour removed about a year ago. Um, and he has hind leg develop hind leg degeneration. So um, we think he's not been quite getting to the right spot. And um, the last couple of days he's come up with a large swelling at the side of his face. Um, so we think that's what's been growing for a while and that's what's been what he's been trying to itch at. Um, today it's got especially noticeably bigger and uh, his eyes bulging forwards. Um, that means that there's quite a lot of pressure built up inside. Um, it's most likely a Zimbol's gland tumour. Um, so this this swelling is part tumour and part abscess. And what tends to happen is the abscess will burst. Um, but it won't heal, it just keeps filling up. Um, and they can actually get an infection which goes into their brain. And it's all very nasty. And he's been through a lot already and he's got a res chronic respiratory infection. And uh, my son's really worried about what could potentially happen to him at home. Um, that could burst open, his eye could be pushed out by the pressure. Um, so we've decided we're taking him to the vet. Just a little bit later on today. And have him put to, to sleep. And let him go with some dignity. Hey. Let him go with a bit of dignity rather than a couple of weeks of pain. So I've got together a little plate full of his favourite foods and we're going to put him back in there for a little while um, before we take him down. in before all the babies get their hands on the food and try and eat it all. Keep bothering you. Try and climb underneath you. 